very first time you and I opened. Fifth test match at the Oval, mm -hmm. 2001. That was the start of it. And we got, a, I think we had 100 partnership first time. Yeah. And we're hugging each other and high. Like, hey, mate, how much fun is this? This is gold. And then that's what, that's what happened. And then we ended up winning the test match and it was awesome. And then remember, we went to, there was a lot of talk the, the next test in Brisbane, mm -hmm. here in Brisbane. Are they going to bring Michael Slater back? Are they going to keep Langer? <coughs> Slater, Langer, Slater, Langer, da da da. And they said, well, he got 100 last game, so we better give him one more. Mm. But now Matthew Hayden, the tall figure closest to camera, and Justin Langer on uh, his left, on the left of picture as he walks out. They did a good job uh, in the Oval Test match, and uh, Steve Waugh certainly will be looking to them to get away to a good start here and to get through as far as they can without losing a wicket. So we're walking out together. I'm walking out with the big groundsman with his World Gym T-shirt. Not and confirmed. We're, we're, confirmed. <laughs> and we walk out to bat together. And I remember the very first ball. That's very close. That's surely. That's out. Wow, that was a very close one. Umpire Daryl Harper. Did he get an edge? That walked to be plum. Plum LBW off Chris Cairns. Plum LBW. And Daryl Harper, not out. <laughs> you beauty. Mate, so I'm not out. So I'm sort of looking at you, you're going, I remember you going, oh no, my poor little bastard, he's, he's not going to play for Australia again. <laughs> not out. So we're going, oh, here we go again. Do -do -do -do, and we're smacking them all over. Good shot. Too short. Pulled away. Short delivery. We thought they might bowl him a few, but he's got onto that one pretty well. And now the pull shot. And that could well be 50, and it will be 50 for Matthew Hayden. He picks him up all right. Straight over mid on into the crowd. Wide delivery, got what it deserved. You can't throw them out there, and that's a 100 partnership. That's where you should not bowl. That is a very, very good strike. And it is 50 for Langer. Beaten field. The brakes have come off. Absolutely no doubt about that. It's the 150 partnership, and that's why there's a little handshake between the two batsmen. That's a beautiful stroke. Nice way to bring up your 100. Timing. Footwork and timing and above all placement because he hit that quite deliberately over the top. I think we've got a 200 partners, we're hugging each other, how much fun is this? Chris Cairns and there is the 200 opening partnership for Hayden and Langer. Well, it's something John Buchanan does plot, the numbers of 50 and 100 and 200 partnerships between these players, making sure that it is improving all the time. Then we get to the next test in Hobart. Thank you, Richie, and good morning to all our viewers right around the world as the Australian pair Hayden and Langer make their way to the crease. Justin Langer on strike. There's going to be three sips of gully, back pad, and surprisingly a cover point in the mid-off, which is rather a defensive field when you send the opposition in. Langer with an average of 41 now. Join the opening position with his partner, Matthew Hayden. Hit one, literally the easiest catch. That's through point. Let's field it. Dropped. Matthew Bell. So it went like a bullet, but it certainly went to hand. It's impossible for an international cricket to drop. And he dropped the catch, right? <laughs> Daryl Tuffy, it was a real body blow. We got off your first delivery. Century Maker in the first test match would have been a tremendous boost for him, but unfortunately it went down. You should catch these. Especially with the man's record, Justin Langer getting off the mark wasn't easy. When you do give him a let off. Certainly makes the most of it. By that stage, I'm back in the test team. I'm gonna, and I'm feeling, starting to think a bit, a bit too think, much I'm starting it. to think a bit about it, right? And this is where partnerships come into it again. And I'm going, oh, dust, you know, I'm starting to think about it. And I'm starting to get stressed out about it. And you you said something. Like, I, just, I said, I just feel like smacking him. And you go, mate, just go for it, mate. Go on for it. Go to the way. The four. Another one, score through the offside, he picks it up and Langer crashes him through cover. Oh, he's put it away again. This is a poor over, really. He's hooked that beautifully, Justin Langer. 
There she goes again. That's a superb stroke. Didn't move Justin Wanger. You can hear the crack of the bat on Weather. Superb cover drive. Here he goes again. Well, this is a slaughter, really. And into the gap. That's a beautifully struck delivery. That was slightly over pitch. That's probably the best shot he's played today. That's his off century. Pushes it away on the onside. He gets lots of runs in that area. Well, it's been a, a pretty interesting start by Justin Langer. Oh, there we go again. Another beautiful cover drive. That's very well played. I am out smacking. That was when I was on 55. You're on one. And you're meant to be the International World Cup player. You get all the accolades. You're the aggressive player. And I'm the blocker. 55. And you're on one. Mate, what a joke. But, and I'll go to 100. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's it. That's very well done. That's 300s in three consecutive test matches for Justin Langer. He's 10th in test match cricket, 6th for Australia, 3rd versus New Zealand in consecutive test matches, and 3rd in the year 2001. Justin Langer has made his century here in Hobart. You should have been thanking me. Well, I am now, publicly. I'm thanking you for saying, just go for it, mate. Thank you to the bank. Saying, like, let's face it, mate, we've got a great punch, but you're a hate us and you're the king and you've, you know, like, <laughs> oh, you're seriously. the smacker, you walk at them and smack them back for six, I was going to block them and fight my, you know, well, like, I've got to be, be there, I'm like the bricklayer, you're like the, you're like the interior designer, you do all the fancy shit, I just do all the hard stuff, but there it is in black and white, 55 and 1, that's what it was. Quite incredible the way he's just come and taken this game by the scruff of the neck, from the, to the point where he was dropped on one, he must have decided then, well, this is my day, and that has been the case. But again, luck. And it wasn't, you said, mate, just go for it. That one just a bit too short, into the gap. And that brings up the 200 partnership between this opening pair. Put into bat this morning, they would have settled for 200 for none. There's no doubt about it. These two, not only have they racked up a good partnership in terms of numbers, just sense when you see their body language between the wicket, they really do enjoy each milestone as a combination.